everyone, so I'm going to be showing you um, what I do before I make an AGSM. So, this is my doll, Leah, but I renamed her Maddie. So, yeah, let's get into so, it. So, all my doll stuff is in my basement. This is what it looks like right now. Uh, so, we're going to have to clean up, except I'll show you the first okay, thing so I do. The first thing I do is I get the dolls ready. So, I've already got some Maria ready, as you saw, she looks pretty good. Um, so, I have this doll to do now. Um, this is my doll, E. So, we're just going to do her hair. So, yeah. Okay, so I finished Eve's hair. It's just straight down. There's a little bit of curl here because her hair is often in a braid that goes back. So, that's why you see a little bit of curl there. So let's do the next doll. The next doll I'm doing is Layla, which is a truly me doll. And Eve was a truly me doll too. So let's do her hair. She's gonna probably have the same hairstyle, but yeah. Okay, so I finished Layla's hair. This is what I did. I just brushed and curled her hair with finger twirling. And then I put a twirl off to the side. And that is that. <laughs> so the next doll we're going to do is probably Emma because her hair is really easily done. So let's do This that. is Emma. It's a truly me doll. I think it's truly me number 24 maybe. But um, her hair is a little messy. I let my friend use her when she comes over. Because she doesn't have any American girls. So I'm not going to do a time lapse of doing her hair because it's so easy. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm just going to spray it. If you're wondering what is in here, it's like a hair softening stuff. I think it's like liquid starch or laundry detergent. I don't know what it's called, but yeah. So I spray her hair with that and then I just brush it, which is super simple. So I'm just going to do that. And I don't usually do much with her hair because it's so hard to put styles in. Except I'm going to see if I can find anything to do with so her. So off camera, I tried ponytails, except it doesn't fully work. So we're just going to keep her hair like this. So I'm going to put her with the other dolls and then give the last doll to... Okay, this is Gabby or Gabriella, Girl of the Year um, for 2018. Wait, no, 2017. So her hair is really annoying to do because I like to do it one by one, except I'm probably not going to do that. Just going to brush it out a little. So yeah. Okay, so I finished her hair finally. This is what it looks like, full spin. So, now that we are done with our dolls, I'm gonna show you some other things before we get into the video I these old Our Generation dolls along with, yeah, there we go, <laughs> along with this one. So this one I washed her hair um, like a few days ago, so I think I'll probably keep her. She has a lot of curls, <laughs> but I also might re-wig her um, using a better wig that's like maybe more straight. And then I have these other dolls. So these ones I really don't use a lot. I use them for like extras and things. So yeah. So the next thing I do is I redress the dolls that I'm going to use. So I'm going to go grab the dolls that I'm going to use for my stop motion. These are the two dolls I'm using. I'm using Gabby to play as well. Gabby. <laughs> And I'm using Layla to play as May. Um, so I have my computer with me, and I'm just gonna write the characters. So I'll tell you when I'm done. Okay, so now we're gonna get them dressed. So I have like a whole drawer of clothes that's on the bottom of that, so they're sort of covering it. So we're gonna pick out some outfits for them. So in the stop motion, um, one of them is wearing the PJs, so I found these PJs. Um, I have matching ones, except I had to get rid of them. 
because I sort of grew out of them. So, and then for Gabby, she's going to wear these shorts. Now, I don't know where these came from because I traded them for something with my cousin. So, these are actually hers. I think they're our generation, I think. Let's see if there's a tag. Yep, our generation. And then I have this shirt, which is a pink um, American Girl shirt. So, let's change it in. Okay, so I don't know really what's wrong with my lighting, but whenever I point it down, it gets like red. But so, just ignore that. But so now they are dressed or in their PJs. So the next thing I do is I set up the the scene. So in the scene, it's a messy room. So I need to go get that done. And I'll show you this. This is Frank. He's my neighbor's cat that comes over here like a lot. Hey, buddy. Hey. Ooh, sleepy. Yes, you're a good boy. Okay. Good night. Okay, now to go set up. Right now, this is what I have in the area. So, it's a one-person room, so I'm going to probably take out that bed, and then I'm going to make it messy, so yeah. This is what the room looks like so far. Um, so, I'm going to sort of make it look dirty now. <laughs> so, it looks so nice, though, so it's sort of, like, sad, but okay, let's do this. So, yeah, this is what it looks like. I just threw a bunch of random things in here, so, yeah. So, anyways, that's that. <laughs> so, now I can start my stop motion. Okay, so I finished Eve's hair. It's just straight down. There's a little bit of curl here because her hair is often in a braid that goes back. So, that's why you see a little bit of curl there. <laughs> so, let's do the next doll.